Okay, I just finished my makeup. This is nothing fancy, just something quick I wanted to post for y'all. So I, like two or three weeks ago, decided that I was going to look into the Hourglass brand because I knew that they weren't totally, so I only use clean makeup products and I knew they didn't use a lot of bad ingredients, but I wanted to look and see just look at more into them. So I did and I found out that a lot of their products are good. So I started out with this little teensy tiny mini. <laughs> it's called the ambient ambient. I say ambient. So we're going with that. Um, lighting powder in luminous light. So you can see it has a little bit of a sheen to it. And it's a finishing powder. So this is the very last thing that you put on when you're doing your makeup. And you can see that I didn't use this one today, but the color that I did use, you can see. Like this is not, like I don't look oily at all. I was just looking at my mirror up here. Um, it's just a very nice sheen. So this is what I started out with. And after the first or second day that I used it, I was like, I need more from this brand. So I went on a hunt and I purchased four more things. <laughs> so the next thing was this. So it's three of the powders and this is the ambient lighting palette volume one. I also have <clears throat> volume three and I actually use these two today as a bronzer. And so this one is like a matte and this has a little bit more of a shimmer to it. And I like mixing them because they just gave me the perfect little color. So like I said, volume three, volume one. So I will use this all over and I have mixed all three of them. I've done them individually. This is the one I have on today. And like I said, this is volume three and I use this bronzer, eyeshadow, whatever you want. So I got those and then I also got this it's the ambient lighting edit and this is the universe shade they have another one i think it's unlocked universe or something like that and it's just got a little bit darker colors so i really liked this one this is going to be great for um traveling because you have a bronzer here highlighter two blushes and then a finishing powder here as well this is not the same as these this one is called the, I think it's Infinity Powder. So it's got a little bit more, number one, it's got like several different all in one, but it also has a little bit, I don't know if you can see it, but it's got a little bit more of a sparkly sheen to it. So I really like all of that. I'd use that, that's gonna like, I don't know if I said this, but it's gonna be great for travel. And then today I use this for the first time and I am obsessed and going to buy all of the colors. This is their blush. It is infused with one of the finishing powders. So you have the blush and then you also have the finishing powder. I don't remember what the finishing powder is in this one, but this blush is called Diffused Heat. It is the perfect corally, summery, springy color and I am obsessed. I have never had a blush and I've used a lot of blushes. I have never had one go on so smooth and not splotchy. I mean, it's literally perfect. I have, like I said, never had a blush go on the way that this one has gone on. So that is all I got. Like I said, I'm going to buy more blushes right now. Um, I just love everything. So my other tip is where I get them from. So this is the mini size and I got this from Sephora and it is $26. They also have their finishing powders individually instead of like in this palette. They don't just come in the palette. And this is <clears throat> the, indivi the yeah, individual size. So this mini size is $26. This full size is $50, I think, of the finishing powder. So I don't recommend getting them from there. <laughs> what I did is I went on the Mercari, Mercari, I'm not sure how you say it, app and got all of the four of these minus that mini size. So these two, the ones with the three were, they're normally $68. I got them for like $35 a piece and they were based, I mean, they were new. Um, some of the stuff on there is used, 
but it's like barely used, like maybe somebody swatched it, didn't like it, decided to sell it, um, or whatnot. If most of the time, if it's used, people will sanitize it, but if not, just take an alcohol wipe and wipe that sucker off and you're ready to go. This uh, is like $43 brand new or like from a retail store. I got this one for, I think it was like $25 and it was brand new. It came in the box and everything. So like I said, great place to buy all this stuff. And then this is $80. I know it's at Ulta. I'm not sure if Sephora has it and I know it's on the Hourglass website and it's $80 in all of those places that have it. I got this for 55 or 60. I can't remember exactly what it was, but it was brand new, never been touched. Um, yeah. So those are my tips. I don't get paid to say that any of this, um, I'm just doing this because I have found some products that I absolutely love and I wanted to share with them with y'all. Um, but yeah, I, you, it, if you are looking for some makeup just to spruce things up a little bit, highly, highly recommend the Hourglass brand and all of those products that I mentioned. I'll put everything down in the description and then I can put a link, I guess, to the Mercari app. Um, it's, I just use the app on my phone. I think you can also use like Mercari.com, um, for like a website or as their website. Uh, so yeah, those are my tips. You can also make offers on there. Um, and a couple of these I did offer a little bit less and some were accepted, some were not. So it's just whatever you're comfortable paying with. Um, if you need swatches of different things, just go to Google and type in hourglass ambient and tons of stuff will come up. That's how I figured out like all the colors that I wanted. And I think that's all. So I'm going to post this and I hope y'all have a great day. And I hope you enjoyed this and I hope you find something you love from it. <laughs>